number one, I wanted to be on Dancing with the Stars because it's like the first competition opportunity I've had in over a year now since I broke my neck at PBR, you know, riding bulls, competing there. And um, when they gave me the opportunity and said, would you like to do this? I jumped right on it. I was like, heck yeah, <laughs> I'm ready to compete again. Just, you know, my regular therapy from things I was doing before I got hurt in my bull riding, you know, kind of training and doing therapy for other injuries have has really kind of bled over into my recuperation from my neck. And part of that is hot yoga. I do a lot of hot yoga. I do Tai Chi. I get in the steam room and do a lot of these stretches and swimming, running, you know, all kinds of stuff. I think I am yet to find out what Bonner brings to this competition, but uh, in getting to know him and getting to know his story, I know he's highly competitive, incredibly determined, uh, and the fact that you do hot yoga and Tai Chi, I mean, that just means that you're very aware of your body and you know how to move. Yeah, I think you're flexible. I am. I'm pretty flexible, especially for a guy who broke his neck. He's a year flexible. Ago, so. This is amazing. I feel like he's going to have some dance moves. Actually... Bonner tells me that he's really good down at the honky tonks, <laughs> and I am yet to find out what that means. But I, uh, I'm excited for him to show me his dance moves. I can do a little boot scoot boogie. Yeah, I am very competitive. I mean, my whole life I've grown up, you know, playing sports. Aside from rodeo, I played baseball and soccer, and was in martial arts. So that uh, drive to win is definitely there, and I've always wanted to be the best at whatever I do. So. I kind of think I saw that in Shorna, which is another reason she was like my top pick because she's done very well on the show, obviously, and uh, she's you know had a lot of success and she's an amazing dancer. So I'm ready to uh, let you know. Hopefully, we can feed off of each other, and that'll be a good fire. Um, I'm used to live TV uh, competition for PBR. What I was doing in pro bull riding, you know, that's all live filmed and. Um, I've dealt with a lot of pressure under thousands and thousands of fans before, um, you know, not a young rookie yet competing under those circumstances. So I think that gives me a little edge in a way for this show. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. I feel like Bonnet is very excited about wearing the spandex onesie. <laughs> what? <laughs> a spandex onesie? Yeah. I hope that's your costume you're Hot talking pink. about. <laughs> yeah. I would never put you in a spandex onesie just, just I, so weekly. You know, I've kind of gotten an overview of, like, what we're wearing, and I think it's going to be all right. You know, I'm a little iffy on some things, but don't want to be dubbed as the rhinestone cowboy out there for sure.